Uh, 52 degrees this morning. That is 11 degrees centigrade. It's not too bad. It's a little breezy. It would be nicer if it wasn't. Come on, Bella. Come on, baby. There she is. So, uh, last night, I think I watched um, The Great North. Two episodes of The Great North I had on DVR. And then... Watched some Myth Brigade, and Tater Tots was on playing uh, that music. There's a musical video game-ish, and uh, it was kind of cool. I helped out a little bit with that in a couple places. Yeah, maybe just one. I just jotted in chat the order things were supposed to go as she figured it out. So she had it right there, convenient. Whew. Come on, Bella. Come on. It was fun. I watched her too, way too late. So it was 11 before she got off. And then uh, I was kind of puttering around online when I heard mom calling. She had to go to the bathroom. So it actually worked out really well that I stayed up that late. So if I had gotten to bed by 10, I either would have been trying to sleep. I would have been asleep, and sometimes right after I fall asleep, I'm really hard to wake. The rest of the night, I'm just like, I hear a barely a sound and I wake up. So I helped her out, got to bed by midnight. So hard, had some dreams. Um, and then up at like 6.30 when the dogs got up, but then, no, I was up at six and I tried to get back to sleep till about seven. I might have dozed. I did have a dream. Okay, this one's weird. I was playing the newest Minecraft with Matt and Adam, maybe Aaron's friends of mine. And, uh, but we were all playing on one screen, but we all could see our own characters, you know? Um, we weren't, hey, Bella, no, no, come on. Bella, good girl, come on. Hey, hey, get out of there, come on, come on. So we, which it didn't seem like that was unusual. I had this controller and I found a city. Don't ask me what that even supposed to be. It was like a big brass city above ground. And it didn't look like Minecraft, it just was supposed to be Minecraft. So, I'm trying to get in there because there's treasure in these cities. But I hit the wrong button, I keep hitting the wrong button. And all the guards come and attack us. And they're kicking our ass and we're running away. And I keep hitting the wrong button. Um, there's a big knob on the top of the controller. And I was accidentally pushing down on it, you weren't supposed to because that's, I guess, the attack function. And there was a girl there in a blue dress, short blue dress. Very cute. Reminds me of uh, in Berlin, a friend, uh, former friend of mine, and uh, was sitting on the couch next to me. On it was a love seat, and I was crowding her. I felt like so I moved my legs, and she was like, "That's fine," but she seemed like hostile, you know, like she was being polite, but did not like me. Did not like me there at all. And I was like, "All right, that's fine. It's it's what it is." She was very pretty. Um, and so something happened that we couldn't play in that place anymore. Like something broke. So they were going to go play someplace else. And I was like, well, I'm going to call it a night and head home. And uh, so we all got up to leave. And she's walking next to me. And she kind of reaches. I don't know if she took my hand or I took hers. And I said good night. And I kind of squeezed her hand twice. And that was it. And then that was when I kind of woke up, I guess. And I got thinking about it. After I woke up, like it was a real thing, like, I wonder if she knew me but didn't know them. I wonder if she wanted to keep playing but couldn't because I wasn't going to keep playing. And then I kind of felt bad, but I shouldn't because it's just a dumb dream. I don't know. I heard online someone calling, walking their dog, a sniffari, where they let the dogs choose the pace. And they uh, let them sniff as long as they want and that kind of thing. I just love that. I, I love the term. Because I've been trying to do that for a while now. 
with limits. I don't want them going back in the woods. All right, girls. 56 degrees this afternoon. That's 13 degrees centigrade. I've been interrupted over and over and over again, but we didn't have to go anywhere today, so that was good. I'm working on the December release. I got the first section pretty much done. Don't know how pleased I am with it. I'm gonna have to rethink it at some point. Good girl, Hope got sick right before we went on this walk, which I'm not a fan of. Uh, I got laundry done today. I only did a couple of loads, but I had to do a third load because this one got sick twice. Oof, I think there was a lot of grass in it. So, uh, not much to report. Mom and I both had kind of a light lunch. I think I'm gonna warm some pizza up for supper and some vegetables. We'll have not warm, but cold. And then uh, might watch one episode of Bob's Burgers. Then I'm gonna try to get working on the second section of the scenario tonight. Because I'm so far behind. Uh, lost the phone. Uh, one of the landline phones I couldn't find for a while. It's my fault. I lost it. I don't know. It's just been a frustrating day. Wait, Bella, this way. Bella, come this way. Come this way. Good girl. Good girl. Oh, she's so good. That's it for now. I almost forgot. We had a lightning storm come through last night. Poor Christy was scared to death. I made her a little tent. To, to lie under, but she didn't like it. She eventually went downstairs. A lot of rain. I didn't check to see how much, but it felt like a lot. 